is a Fortnite skin channel, I should not have to make this video. So, I'm sorry guys for the background gameplay being old, I have no new gameplay because of this whole scenario. So today guys, I'm going to be talking about the P90 and the new nerf to walls in Fortnite. So, let's talk about the P90. It received the hotfix today, which changed absolutely nothing. All SMGs did nothing, and well, I'm going to talk about this. The SMGs are actually not the problem, only the P90 is. So, the P90 being nerfed, it obviously was a good step in the right direction but it has completely changed the game and it still did change nothing i don't think fortnite has learned from this or epic and well fortnite oh my god you have a whole new problem on your hands so you guys know how the whole shotgun meta was you know it was over like people thought it was horrible people were about to leave the game because it just it was horrible shotguns were just so bad it was a reliable item and now we have an smg as a reliable item and the problem with that is the fact that the P90 is obviously OP, and we have walls being horrible. So with the P90 being OP, it just kills people instantly. Basically, your building does not matter. Game anymore. Like it's just because there's no decision making. It's literally you see someone you just hold left click. There's no decision making. There's no counterplay. And to me, it's like it's barely a game at that point. You're just with it, even if building was the same as a couple days ago, or when it be before its nerf, it would not change anything at all. And I'm gonna sound very tired in this video because I, I, I've been trying to make it, but I can't. But it, it's just horrible. All right, you, you just kill people extremely fast. If you get it in the beginning of the game, you're basically won that area. Is when you guys know the deal with the SMG. You're probably seeing clips on screen here of. You know, it's penetration <laughs> of, you know, it's just like, it's just, it legitimately just demolishes any target and should not be in the game at all. The SMGs, you know, they're fine, obviously, the, the, the regular SMG, it's a little OP, but it's still a good item that you can actually, you know, build against, or you used to be able to build against, which brings me to my next point, which is <laughs> building. Building does not matter anymore. Building is legitimately a horrible thing to be nerfed. Building is the one thing that we all wanted to stay. You know, building, or we want more mats. We don't want a decrease in mats. So let's go over the problems. We got a decrease in materials, and now we have a decrease in health. You can legitimately, if you have an automatic weapon, building does not matter to your opponent. I'm a good player. I like to say that. I have 140 solos. I go for high kill games all the time. I should be able to 1v2 somebody. I'm going to imagine this. Imagine this, okay? Okay, listen, 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 listen. I'm going to make the screen black because I reach quit and I do not have the clip anymore. So, I'm going to make the screen black. Listen to this, guys. I am in a 1v2 situation, right? My friend is dead. I come across some people. I'm bill battling them. You know, it's... I honestly... No, I'm getting the eye ground a little bit better than both these guys. And then they start spraying me. They start absolutely demolishing me. They just keep spraying and spraying and spraying. So to point out where I'm like at 30 health, so I back off, right? So I back off. I use my bounce pad to get down the mountain that I'm at. And it's ending on a big mountain. And I kind of get down to a lower part, box myself in. And then I use a campfire and two minis. So now I'm at 130 health. I basically make my way back up the mountain. I'm at 130 health, feeling a little bit confident. I box myself in at the bottom of the build battle that we had, thinking that maybe they'll fight the, the other two people who are still alive, or the other three people, I forget. That didn't happen. They found me. I guess they heard me come up, and then they heard me box myself in. All right, they see me. They are looking at me through my brick, so I build a stair. I'm about to edit my way out. I'm dead. Want to know why? One had an LMG, and one had a regular SMG. All right, that was a matter of three seconds. They saw me, I built a stair, about to edit my way out, I'm dead. Because they were able to go through my wall and my stair in a matter of about three seconds, which is absolutely ridiculous. A good player should be able to edit their way out of a box before they are shot through their wall and their stair, which is fully made out of brick, by the way. Except for the stair, obviously, but the brick is fully healed up. You know, it's got all of its health. And it's just, it has become ridiculous. There is nothing that you can do anymore about 
building building is basically becoming one of those things that are just not good people are good at this game now and fortnite has not noticed that people are really good and they're taking this advantage high ground if you don't have high ground in this game right now obviously a couple days ago or a couple weeks ago it was that you were able to achieve high ground now you have no chance if you're in a 1v2 you have no chance is what I'm trying to get at. Hope you guys, like, kind of understand what I'm coming at. I'm really bad at explaining things sometimes in a detailed way. Hopefully you guys got, like, the gist of the things. Because, like, the P90 is OP. SMGs should not be this overpowered in a game. And the walls should never have been weakened. The, the wall, We never experienced any nerf to health of walls, so why now? People boxed up. That was the reason why they did it. They basically fixed the problem but caused another. People boxed up to see C4, man. It's not that hard. And let's get into the, the whole solution I think that we have is to bring back the shotgun meta. I know, the, probably the worst thing that you wanted to hear, but it's the only option at this point. We got to deal with it. Take the P90 out of the game. Bring back TAC SMG. Take that, S that, that regular SMG again out. All right? Make... The SMGs a little bit worse before they added the regular SMG. So you guys remember when they took out the TAC SMG? Make it a little bit worse than that. Bring back the pumps. Doing 95 or bring back the whole. Actually, you went. Never mind. I'm not even. Bring back just pumps doing 95 damage and SMGs actually kind of sucking, but they're gonna be really good because now you're gonna you're not gonna have double shotgun, so it's gonna be pumps doing 95 damage, and they're not gonna be able to double pump, so it's gonna be pump SMG and everything will be fixed. I'm telling you guys that right now. If that the shotgun meta basically comes back, the shotgun meta will be the best thing that they can do. Take out the new SMGs, bring back the old ones, bring back the old SMG style of damage and drop off damage and stuff and make it so the reliable ball the best option that you want to do is either one tack or a pump SMG or heavy SMG. I know I, I'm making this all as one commentary because I have a horrible headache and I gotta get to bed but I want to get this video up. I'm sorry guys that maybe I didn't edit it as much but I tried to find as much clips as possible of people dying to this new SMG and it's impossible to push people. It's impossible to be boxed up now. It is impossible for anything to happen for you to win if you do not have a teammate. Or if you're in solos and you get sandwiched. Sorry guys, but this game might be dying because of it. I don't want to sound like the negative person here. But this game, if they do not fix this whole SMG meta... It, it, I'm just going to play Playground. I'm just playing playground, all right? I'm a good builder. I'm a good fighter. But when this whole SMG comes and no skill, there's no skill gap, we have a problem.